if your fire alarm control panel is giving out a maintenance trouble, it means that your smoke detector could be dirty or have dust in it, which could prevent it from activating when it needs to and can send out false alarms. Normally, this base should be mounted to an electrical box. So like you just saw me do, you're going to twist it counterclockwise like you're opening a um, jar. And here's the active smoke detector, same thing for the top. This could be harder. Twist it hard like you're opening a jar counterclockwise. Let me put the camera down. All right, now that I have that piece off, you'll see there's little vents in there for that. You want to remove this, kind of blow out on the inside and outside of this to get any dust off. As you can see, both there are two holes there. Both of those need to be cleaned out. You can try blowing on them, but you may have to get compressed air in a can to clean those out effectively. And once you're done, there are a couple holes on this that need to be lined up. If I can find them. Yes, as you can see. So just, that literally just twist around, you can find it fit back in place. And then twist this clockwise like you're closing a jar. Okay. All right, go ahead and close this clockwise, twist it clockwise if you'll be closing a jar. It should snap right into place. As you can see, I've done it. If for some reason you're trying to get it and it won't close, check these tabs, make sure they're pressed in. Like right now, this one's sticking out a little bit, trying to get that to happen. Um, it's going to be normal for it to stick out a little bit, just make sure it's not sticking in a lot. Because that can kind of get in the way and it won't close correctly. With, you know, these guys right here. So, just make sure that those are pressed in. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, you may post them in the comments below.